kindergarten students. Good morning, um, kindergarten parents and students. My name is Nurse Kelly, and I am the nurse here at Hunter Elementary. So I just wanted to introduce myself um, and that we are excited to have you come to Hunter Elementary for kindergarten. Um, before your child comes to kindergarten, there are a few things that they need. Uh, it is required that they have the necessary immunizations. Their immunization record should be up to date and submit it with their application. Um, they need five DTaP vaccines. They need four polio vaccines. They need two MMR. They need two chicken pox um, and that and three hepatitis B. Um, that makes them eligible for kindergarten. What we also require and the school district requires is an up-to-date physical. Um, so we need a copy of a physical with their application. Um, also, kindergarten students should have an updated dental exam um, and a report from the dentist that everything was um, good when that last time they went to the dentist. I can make those forms available. Um, my email is M-E-K-E-L-L-Y at P-H-I-L-A, S is in Sam, D is in dog, dot O-R-G. My phone number here at the school is 215-400-7110, and I'm here every day except for Wednesdays. We work from home right now. Uh, I wish I could tell you what school will look like in September, so I'm not really exactly sure, but we are doing a great job right now in the springtime um, keeping uh, people safe here, keeping students and staff safe. Um, the other things that your child may need, if you have a child that has a chronic illness, um, a common one is asthma, and you think that your child will need an asthma inhaler while they are in school here, so maybe they go out for recess or they go out for PE, and they come back in and they're a little short of breath and they need their inhaler. Um, there are forms that need to be completed by the child health care provider and then sent in with an inhaler in a box with their name on it like you get from the pharmacy. And oftentimes, healthcare providers can write for two inhalers, one for home and one for school. This way, you don't have to worry about not having one in the house. Um, but if that's the case, then we need to know um, uh, about your child and their asthma. If there's other medication that your child would have to take during the day, then that's a conversation we need to have and paperwork needs to be filled out so that we do it all the correct way. Other than that, that's it. We look forward to um, a new class of kindergartners coming to Hunter Elementary. I've mentioned my phone number and my email. Um, I'm available, like I said, every day except for Wednesdays. Thank you so much.